Hey folks, Kayak DIY here, and right now I'm standing at the Pegasus Thruster booth at DEMA. This is uh, a dive show, and it has really cool stuff. One of my friends, Life of Mac Matt Jackson, actually told me to come and check this out at this booth. So I'm here with Marissa, and we're going to end up going over the Pegasus and what it has to offer. So what can you tell me about it? Awesome. So the Pegasus Thruster is a tank-mounted DPV, and the ideal component is that your hands are free. So whether you're shooting video or photo, working with equipment, your hands are free to move about. It really is just as simple as pushing one button. That's it. Now the way it mounts together is here on a bracket and strap system, so you can have all of your equipment, your PC, your regulator, with the base and strap on and put this in a tank holder. And then the shroud was designed to fit in a tank holder as well, because a lot of boats don't want equipment rolling around, damaging things, and you certainly don't want to damage your unit. And so once you're ready to go, that's it. We do have a locking pin that goes through to protect that lever just in case it were to get hit. And here's your battery end of the unit. It's a nickel metal hydride battery, so it's nice and easy to be able to ship, fly, travel. We travel all over the world with them. But a really fun component is that it's underwater pluggable. So if you wanted to carry another battery with you or stage it, um, you can do so. Wow. But even if not, in between dives, you can take it off, throw it in your dive bag, deal with it later. You don't have to baby the unit. It's made for the element. There, what's else? It makes a great margarita maker <laughs> after the dive. But uh, during the dive, if you were to ever get anything ingested in the motor, there's actually a clutch. So it's going to you know, stop and protect it. And once you do disengage anything that's in there, the motor will re-engage. Wow, it seems like you guys thought of just about everything. I love that you can actually have an extra battery carried and uh, basically drop it in when you need it underwater. That's, that's remarkable. I don't know of any other people that are really doing that. Um, so really cool. I think the thing I like about it in terms of what I'm starting to get into is I'm starting to get into like fossil hunts. A lot of my friends were, were needing to use our hands. We need our hands free. We don't want a lot of gear all floating around in front of us. And I like the fact that it's just out of the way. The only thing that's there is this and I can have this tethered so it sucks to my side a little bit if I want to be more streamlined and I can pull it out and use it when I need it. So I think that's what really makes this stand out to me. And like I said, some of my other friends that are doing what I'm doing, they told me I needed to come here and it's catching a lot of attention. So you guys are gonna have to check them out. The link will be in the description below and who knows, maybe I'll run over to Miami and check out these guys and do a demo.